Hey guys, it's prediction time and review time of last weekend's predictions and accumulator. And I, of course, are Dynasty Night in 85. Welcome. Hope you all have had a good week. The weekend is finally with us and the Premier League, of course, is back with us as well. Happy days. Get in. Um, but, uh, however, I do want to say fantastic congratulations to England. Uh, really, really pleased with the 2-1 victory over Croatia. Um, we predicted that correctly. Just saying, just saying. And um, yeah, so looking forward to, I think it's next June, the semi-finals are. Uh, should be interesting to see how we get on um, with that sort of, I, I say competition, it it, it is. Um, you know, it would be nice to get to the final, you know, um, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, but yeah, really, really pleased. So uh, fantastic. Anyway, moving on. Uh, the predictions uh, went as follows. Concerning perfect scores, we managed to get three out of 14, which quite frankly isn't too bad whatsoever. Um, obviously, one game was the England game we got correct. The other games were, bear with me, what were they? Ah, Azerbaijan winning 2-0 against Faroe Islands. And the England game, of course, and then it was San Marino... Not San Mourinho, because that wouldn't make sense. Um, against Belarus. Belarus winning away by two goals. So, uh, yeah. So, those were our three. And uh, concerning correct results, we got six out of 14, which um, just under half. Not great. So, I'm hoping for a better percentage, if you know what I mean, for uh, this weekend's up and coming prediction. So, we shall wait and see. And as concerning the accumulator from last weekend... Pretty disappointing. Just uh, just another rubbish weekend concerning the accumulator anyway. Well, obviously, Sunderland drawing at home against um, Wickham. Uh, you got Peterborough. Always oh, letting me down at the very end, Peterborough. You know, ugh, it's, it's frustrating because they, they are a decent team, but they just, every time I bet on them, they just mess up for me. So anyway, so they drew 1-0 at home against Bradford. And, uh, and then you had Forest Green, who lost at home to Morecambe by one goal. So that was the accumulator. We move on. So concerning our predictions for this weekend, the 13th, excuse me, the 13th uh, week of the Premier League, for those that didn't know. And uh, the predictions comes as follows. First off, the three o'clock games on Saturday, Brighton against Leicester. Come on, Brighton. Uh, hopefully we can bounce back against uh, Leicester with the, after that disappointing defeat against Cardiff. Um, I have predicted a 2-1 victory to Brighton Hove Albion. But it will be a really, really tough game because Leicester are a decent side. So 1-0 um, would be obviously just as great. But uh, we're going to predict 2-1 anyway. Uh, and then you've got Everton at home against Cardiff. We're going for a 3-0 victory to Everton. Uh, Fulham with their new manager, Claudio Ranieri. Um, a 2-1 victory to start off. Uh, against Southampton. Sorry, Southampton. Um, and then you've got Manchester United at home against Crystal Palace. Guess what? Man um, United to win by uh, two goals to now. Um, Watford at home against Liverpool. We're going for an away win. So 2-1 to Liverpool. Uh, and then we've got West Ham at home against Manchester City. Uh, we're going for a 3-1 victory for Manchester City. And then the later kickoff, you've got Spurs against Chelsea. Another London derby. A really tough game for both sides. Um, I actually think Spurs are going to do it. I think Spurs will pinch it 1-0. Um, I just think home advantage uh, for Spurs. Um, I just, yeah, pretty. Uh, there's no real explanation, really. I just think Spurs are going to win 1-0 at home. Simple as that, really. Uh, and then for the Sunday games, we've got Bournemouth at home against Arsenal. We're going for an away win for Arsenal by two goals to one. Uh, and then we've got Wolves at home against Huddersfield. We're going for a 2-0 victory for Wolves. And then the Monday night football is Burnley against Newcastle. And we're going for a 1-0 victory to Burnley. So those are the predictions for this weekend. Let me know what your predictions are. Or if there's a particular team that you support, what do you predict they're going to win by? Because obviously you're not going to predict your own team to lose. But uh, yeah, let me know in the comment section. Anyway. As for the accumulator, a sevenfold accumulator this weekend. Uh, going to go with the teams as follows. Um, Everton, they're at home against Cardiff. 
Manchester United, they're at home against Palace. And then in the Championship, we got Stoke, they're at home against QPR. Swansea, at home against Norwich. Uh, and then we've got Barnsley against Doncaster in League One. Uh, also with Charlton, they're at home against Bristol City. And then in League Two, we've got Colchester at home against Exeter. The odds on that are 77.65 to 1. Uh, our usual, well, no, actually, £3 bet. Um, we've had a few £4 bets, but that's been a waste of time. So £3 this weekend. Uh, so if that comes in, it'll be a total of £235.69. So yeah, so that's the um, prediction and the accumulator for this weekend. Uh, hope you all have a really, really good weekend. Fingers crossed your team uh, comes in with a result, apart from Leicester fans. And uh, yeah, let's see how we get on. Anyway, for now, take care. Cheers. Bye.